See, the RDS is buzzing with students showing their commitment, dedication and hard work for their projects. And for one school in Mallow in County Cork, this hard work paid off when they won the inaugural Irish VEX Robotics Competition. And Davis College now have the distinction of being the first school to represent Ireland at the World Championships in California. Maria Malarkey has more. The VEX Robotics Competition gives schools around the globe the opportunity to entice their students into the world of science and technology through a competition with robots built and programmed by the students themselves. The first time the school has ever entered anything like this, um, so basically I was teaching and I just told the, the students about what, what the competition was about and invited them all to come at lunchtime to check it out. Um, and we were swamped with people in the first few weeks and we eventually got it down to 23 people on the whole team. Um, so every lunch break and after school, the students stayed in with their lunch boxes under their arm and they worked on the robots. EMC were great help to us. Uh, straight away we were set up with two mentors because we got two robots we were entitled to two mentors. So Dave and Philip used to come down once a week. About six or seven weeks ago when we came in here with a, a box of components and parts and seeing where the kids are taking it, you know, they've gone from not knowing anything about robotics to all of a sudden, seven or eight weeks later, having a robot in a working environment in a competition. And, you know, to see the camaraderie and the teamwork that's been involved, I suppose, collectively with both the kids and, I suppose, the school in general and the, the teachers. It was all too often we put a focus on, on theory. And we've got an opportunity here to see the kids taking that theory and applying it in a practical environment. And, uh, that's primarily why I got involved, really, just to kind of um, see kids having a bit, bit more fun with science and technology. So EMC got involved in the VEX Robotics Competition with a view to supporting the promotion of STEM subjects in schools, STEM being science, technology, engineering and maths. Uh, we need to maintain a pipeline of talent, of engineering talent, through into industry, and we need to capture them early, and what better to capture their imagination than robots. Robots are fun and competing robots are, are just great fun altogether. Um, we saw the robots going one day and then it kind of inspired me really to join it and uh, we took it from there then. There was hours and hours of building put in. Um, we used to work in the mornings, lunch times and after school and evenings and uh, everything was in the kit and it was complete just little bits of metal and we had to put them together and uh, then we programmed it. Well, I was on the fundraising team and it was our job to get the money for building the robots. And we first off held a cake sale and we raised 160 euro with that. And then we used that money to get material for the robots and we got t-shirts then with our names on them. The robot has to literally pick up the sacks and uh, put them into the trough and get the yellow sacks as well, because they're, they're worth more points than the green ones. We had the VEX Robotics competition, which was a full day competition um, involving 12 teams. Two teams actually traveled over from California to participate, and they shared an awful lot of their experience with us, which was, which was fantastic. Um, the competition ran through several rounds, qualification rounds, elimination rounds, through to you know, semi-finals and finals. The excellence award, uh, was well deserved by, uh, by Davis College and Mallow who kind of completely took every aspect of the competition uh, and took it to a whole new level. So they're going to go to the World Championships, they're going to be representing Ireland and I'm sure they're going to do us proud. They're already looking at new designs for their robots so that they have learned from the last competition. The other schools involved have kind of, they want to get another uh, chance to come back and, and compete again. So the, the feedback from the schools has been amazing. The competition has made us all more interested in science really because um, after winning and all that was a big boost and uh, science was never really my subject up until then but now definitely take a lot more interest in it. I've been playing since we came back about everybody wanting to join the robots next year and um, so it's, I think it's great for our science in the school because it's another competition that as you can see even this morning now they were all in looking at the pit and getting really excited about it so it's, it's a great way to get them to learn science and they don't even know they're learning it, you know. So in April we're going to be heading to California so we're hoping to bring a group of 10 students um, over with us. 
We started small this year uh, with eight schools in Cork, but hopefully um, with the interest that's been generated, we've an awful lot of queries coming in looking to get involved, um, this will become bigger and better. And ideally, at the end of it, we'll come out with more people looking to do science and technology courses uh, at the Leaving Cert level and into college. And we'll maintain in the pipeline of, of uh, people coming through into industry.